is Chow. I'm David Navarro. We're going to begin with breaking news. A fiery crash impacting the evening commute. An Eyewitness News viewer sent us this picture. Look at it. A truck on fire along Route 78 in Hunterdon County. Right now, all lanes are closed in the area. Yeah, we're going to go ahead and check in with Joe Nolan. He's in the newsroom with very latest. Joe. Yeah, indeed. And Shannon's over. We're going to show you that in a second. But first, I'm going to show you the delays as you head westbound. You saw that tractor trailer fire again. This was quite a while ago. This is all the way back by Route 31. Again, westbound on 78. So this is several miles away from where that truck is. And you can see it is stopped dead. That's because all lanes are closed. We can go to our maps and put a time on this. But again, it's stopped dead. It's closed. But almost an hour and a half to go 11 miles from exit 23 into exit 12. And like I said, Shannon's there. We're going to show you in a second. For Eyewitness News, I'm Joe Nolan. All right, Joe, thanks a lot. You mentioned Shannon. We're going to go up above the scene. Shannon's own is a news copter 7. Shannon, do we have you? I guess we don't have you. I think we do. I think we're trying to oh. establish. I think we just got there we Look go. at the size wow. of this crash, Shannon. Yeah, this is about as bad as it gets. You know, Joe mentioned it. This is that tractor trailer that was on fire. We are getting word from New Jersey State Police now that this was actually carrying diapers. Obviously, they have mostly gotten the fire out. They're still just making sure they have everything under control. But the big news here is that the accident itself happened at 219 this afternoon, and there is still not a detour in place. This is just beyond exit 13 on the westbound side. And when Joe said these delays are miles, he meant these delays are miles. We were actually able to come up on the end of this delay. It went all the way back to 287, multi-mile delay, and it is not going anywhere anytime soon. For parts, you can take Route 22 as an alternate, but if you can, if you normally drive on Route 78, just avoid this because this is what you're gonna be sitting in. Reporting live over Route 78, Shannon Zone, Channel 7, I would.